Holy moly. Yes. Holy shit. <clears throat> We're back. Did We're I just wake up out of dreams? Like, <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Something feels more like a nightmare. When oh, my PTSD God. Oh, yeah. It's definitely a nightmare. Definitely mm-hmm. a nightmare. But good, but, um, but good news, guys. Yes, great we're, news. We're back. We're back. Your favorite podcast. You know what I'm saying? The Physics Study Group, hashtag TPSG. And we do have a new member amongst us. Uh, Jordan. Oh, God. Jordan Maddox couldn't make it, so um, oh God. his son replaced him. <laughs> Cashew. <laughs> Cashew AKA Mac. Cashew Don't Case. Don't touch me. Why are you touching me? <laughs> Why Mr. Are you touching me? Mr. Cashew Jones. <laughs> so, you do look like the planners. The if you if guy. you've noticed something, I'm kind of missing something. Yeah. yeah, and I just want to say, Cowboys Nation, screw the Eagles. Uh, That's all I gotta say about that. It looks that. like it looks like Illmatic's son is rather upset. Oh man, <laughs> fuming. <laughs> 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 but oh yeah, another word to the wise: do not make bets with your body parts. Yeah, anything you grow naturally, don't make a bet of it. He looks like Russell Wilson in a dimension where. He doesn't go to college. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> and for those of y'all who don't know. It was it was crazy. Give me like two months. I'm gonna be Beard King again. You say yeah. that. As if you were Beard two King months. before. Let's see if your okay. beard has as much faith in itself. <laughs> but <laughs> but yes, we are back after a mild hiatus, I would say. Mild. Yeah. Not too crazy. Mm-hmm. Um and before we go, happy new year, Merry Christmas, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Appreciate happy New Year, it. Merry yeah. Christmas to all y'all. Yeah, yeah. for real. And to all y'all who one love. Who waited patiently for us to, you know, hear this next episode after our little hiatus? We appreciate you, mm-hmm. and you know, continue rocking with TPSG. Hey. But yeah, how was everyone's New Year? Pretty good, pretty good. But you see, now we're going into a new year. Yes. You know, traditions. Traditionally, people come up with these things called New Year resolutions. Mm. So, speaking of New Year resolutions. Do you guys have any? Do you guys? What are your thoughts? I don't do them anymore. I don't know what that word means. Mm. <laughs> I don't. I don't do New Year's. Uh, I don't make New Year's w- re- resolutions anymore. Have you just? Uh, is it what? Was it like the past ones were unsuccessful and you just gave up? Or well, no, it wasn't that. I just don't believe in. Okay, all of a sudden I have to do better in my life because it's the beginning of the year. I feel you. You know what I'm saying? I'm I- on some. You know. Shit that I plan on happening this year, I planned on three years ago. You Word. know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it's just, you know what I'm saying? Just, it's, you yeah. know, now, I'm not saying really your resolutions are bad. Mm. Like, you know, they're good for people. It's it's something that'll push them and, you know, Word. give them a reason to go to the gym or stop smoking or stop drinking or yeah, whatever your New Year's resolution Word. is. It gives you a little incentive. It give, give you a little push. But, you know, I don't make them because, you know, I just feel like you, you're supposed to be like that 24-7, 365 I completely 52 weeks agree, a year. Man. I completely agree with yeah. that. 366 in a jump year. <laughs> Leap year, jump year. Leap. In a jump year. Those, <laughs> those, jump those year. happen every 55 million years. You get, <laughs> a, yeah. you get a jump year. But yeah, that's just me. I, I, I don't make them anymore. I don't see the point. Yeah, that's when the, that's when the universe resets and we start back in the beginning. <laughs> mm-hmm. In the beginning. Year. A jump Whoa. year. I thought yeah. the Whoa. universe skips 10 mm-hmm. years. <laughs> That's some real mind shit. blown, right? Goes from 2018 to 2028. Mm. Mind blown, mind blown, mind <laughs> blown. Right into that whole generation in the middle. Anyway, no, but it yeah, but Mr. I was always oh. no, no, go good. Sorry, I apologize. I mean, I was always the the young dude that sounded like the sixty year old in class mm. talking about New Year's resolutions. I got all year to do better. Word. <laughs> Word. But honestly, in, rea- in that in actuality, that's, that's the truth. Really you know what I mean? Yeah. You mm-hmm. you can start any day. You don't have to just exactly. start exactly. That's on my point. January first. You Word. can start on February 29th if you want to. You know what I mean? Yeah. And what's this pressure to do better? Damn it, I was ain't shit in 2017. I'm gonna be ain't shit in 2000. You bugging? <laughs> another level of ain't shit. Hashtag yeah, you bugging? You gotta love no. me as I am. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> we ain't improving for nobody. What's for that? Real. The way the way take I me look. as I am. <laughs> <laughs> Hey. Oh, yo. <laughs> That's a jam, though. Wow. Yeah, no. Dog brought it back. <laughs> Sticking to your but yeah. Ain't shit no, 2018. No. <laughs> I mean, hashtag. Hashtag yo, hey, if 20. you ain't shit last year and you ain't yeah. shit the it day got, after the year <laughs> when it became January 1st, word. hashtag ain't that's, shit 2018. That's, that's, that's impressive in a way. It is quite it, impressive. It, it, being ain't shit lot. for so many years consecutively, well, yeah, that is to pretty. Be, I no, want to, your consistency. To bro. be ain't shit now, that takes commitment. 
That's yeah, because it's, yeah. it's, it's so many tools for you to not to be in shit. What? You could at least there's be some so much, shit. Yeah. There's, yeah. So, <laughs> there's so much like like opportunities around you to educate and just learn. You're like, no, no, I don't want to learn. No. I don't want to do it. I don't want to be exactly how I am forever in my life. Word. You have to work <laughs> hard to be in shit. You yeah, actually bro. in 2018. And they're, and they're out there working yeah. hard. So <laughs> <laughs> what if their resolutions are... To continue the streak, <laughs> you, you know what I'm saying? Like you know what? Continue the streak. I'm be ancient. Women's uh, women, women people love consistency, right? <laughs> right. I'd say it's fire higher, bro. Yeah, that nigga was eight, eight shit ten years straight. Hey, not, I mean, that, there's something to be said. I mean, like <laughs> what? What can I say? Like he's he's consistent with his shit. This, <laughs> but Mr. Zulu, what you feel about him? Well, whoa. I feel sorry, like... There sorry, is, we just have um uh, mountain lions in the back. <laughs> no, there's actually We're, an insane in, in sunny asylum California. next door. Word. You heard so the, the mu- sound creeps over. You heard the mountain lion. <laughs> you just might hear that randomly. It's just the mountain lion. <laughs> well, yeah. In the back Zulu. of New Orleans. Word. Well, <laughs> I think, you know, I think they're great. I think it's good to have, you know, um, to, to, to send a pointer of say, okay, I'm going to do this. But <laughs> I feel like if you just say, oh, I'm going to do this for my New Year's re- resolution, chances are it's not going to work. Yeah. You have to have like a habit. Of goal setting, because literally yeah. that's what it is. You set your goals for the year, mm-hmm. so that if you're not used to, or if that's not something that you do normally, like set goals and then pursue those goals throughout like long, short and long term you know, period of time, you know it, it's not really gonna work just because you exactly. up and want to do it, yeah. you know, mm-hmm. cause just cause it's New Year's. So do you? I mean, I guess with. In light of that, saying that, mm. maybe a suggestion is trying to change a habit rather than making a New Year's resolution. Word. Starting yeah, yeah. from the base, yeah, from the ground up, because mm. you need a foundation, right? Mm-hmm. And that's mm-hmm. that's the way I looked at it. Oh, what, what you was going to say, Mr. Boomaya? I was going to say that can definitely happen, because once you get that one repeated action and mm-hmm. behavior down repetition like it kind of it, it, it helps it that becomes next easier. behavior you know what i mean yeah it becomes easier you get one good habit down the next good habit is no sweat anymore mm-hmm. as that's i was true. talking with y'all earlier that's true. i recently changed that and this had nothing to do with new year's i happened to move took the opportunity of moving to purge some of my life and i decided <laughs> to change a habit of not putting my clothes up when I come home. I just throw it on a chair. What happens with that? Mm. A pile Uh accumulates. Mm -hmm. And that's how you get a mess. So now, every day when I come home, Mm. I hang my clothes. If I'm a... If I'm if I'm not gonna wash it, mm. but I'm gonna keep it for one more wear, I hang it outside the closet so it can air out for a few hours, mm. and I put it back inside the closet, man, like an old nigga Word. all day. <laughs> but guess what? <laughs> when I come back in the room after do it, <laughs> I'm ready to go, man. I ain't gotta clean nothing up. Word. I don't Word. I don't I'm not missing anything. I know where everything is. It's crazy, man. It's it's different. It's Word. funny you say that because. Although we're saying you shouldn't wait for January 1st to begin your New Year's resolution, I mean, there's always something, there's always like a good power in new beginnings. Mm. So although like Sir Flock Azulu said, you should always be striving for that next goal, that next step. I mean, I feel like January 1st or the new year, you know, it takes some time to reassess, takes some time, you know, to think inward, be honest with yourself. Mm. Actually, if you haven't written your goals down, write them down. If you Mm want to think of them a little bit more deeply, go ahead and do that. Take the opportunity of a new beginning to Mm. do something. And you know what I mean? We're humans. We we, we like the rigidity. You know what I mean? We like the, okay, I can start today. Mm. Right. You Mm -hmm. you notice a diet never starts on a a Wednesday or a Thursday. It always starts on Monday. Monday. Like, yeah, Yeah. I'll I'll go wait till next Monday. All right, because I, I had this party this weekend so yeah, just getting yeah. it off <laughs> but um one thing you one thing you said I want to <clears throat> I want to piggyback off of and I feel like it's very important very imperative is writing stuff down mm-hmm. because you can think it all you want but nobody has a perfect memory if you write it down it will be somewhere you know what I'm saying right. like get this I'm not saying write it down and share it to everybody but get this idea out of your head put it on paper mm-hmm. you know you know, I know you know that phrase put it mm-hmm. on paper makes it real yeah, yeah makes it real exactly. I don't care if your goal is yeah. to Write a movie or stop eating M and M's. Like it doesn't yeah. matter. Write your goal down mm-hmm. so it can be real. It can be tangible, and you can look at it like you know, this is what I'm gonna do. Somewhere yeah. you can see it every day too. It, so oh. it reinforces mm-hmm. it right? without you even realizing. Yeah, it. Oh. put that shit on your vanity. And you know, 
It we joke about tangible. it, but somebody out there is like, M and M's have ruined my life. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. You, you don't know what people's addictions are. Where? But remember, we True. said that mm-hmm. at last episode, we're here to protect your kinks and your addiction. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to tell anybody. This is yours. What are you Word. talking about? It's yours. Word. <laughs> Word. You don't. Know, you don't know, owe anybody a good thing. Thing. That. That. I'm. I'm trying to cuss less now. I guess that, was, <laughs> that might be a resolution. That's a of part of resolution. Yeah. Now, um, my mama listens to the podcast. She don't like, she don't like the cussing. So. Now, have you ever made? Not have you ever made, but do you make like the the default resolutions? Like, oh, lose weight, save money, da 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 da. Like, you, you ever made a resolution that was like unique? You know, say I'm gonna stop eating wake stop on Tuesdays or something mm. like some very specific <laughs> word because everybody has the general oh I'm gonna go to the gym first of I'm all. gonna save money mm. I'm gonna change I'm gonna stop smoking gonna stop drinking gonna stop cursing you know the typical stuff like give me something but not too personal give me something like you had to stop it like you know what first of all I, shout out to Rick Ross I don't think I could ever stop eating <laughs> wake stop <laughs> oh yeah, I had it last <laughs> night. I'm not sure I can cut that last night. night. <laughs> you really but got just, something going there, by the way. Oh, it's I so did, good. Dang, I had a wing stop <laughs> yesterday. Too. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I didn't have a wing stop yesterday, but I did have some wings. <laughs> and they was wow. Fried. We all had wings yesterday. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's wild. wild. I had some wing public powers, wings but I definitely my refined <laughs> my refined palate went to Carabas. <laughs> oh, 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 hey, I don't like Carabas <laughs> anymore. I don't like Carabas anymore. Have you seen the revamped portions? What oh, they mean? revamped it again? Bro, that menu was great, and I ate there yesterday, and the portions were straight. Bro. Okay, because the last that. time I went, they gave us like sample portions for entree prices. We, I was like, yeah. we're, we're, we're literally having a Carabas review Tangent. right now. So, <laughs> and yes, it does serve as a where, TPSG. Where, that was a delicious ah, yes. Tangent. First, First one, one of the year. year. Yeah. Yes. Jinx, wow. I got wood. I don't drink wow. soda, but, t- Yes, We but, did um, bring those back for two yeah. But yes. Oh, yeah, give me, give me some like... Resolutions you made, I was like, you know, real specific. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we have to think about that one. Probably like, I remember. <laughs> no bird chest. No bird chest. No bird chest. Thousand <laughs> every year. <laughs> oh yeah. Sidebar. No. This has been going on. When did I meet you? <laughs> see, all right. Since so 2010. <laughs> see, I've been trying to grow a chest for years now. <laughs> <laughs> my 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 problem. I know my problem. My problem is consistency. Mm. Okay. With my diet and w- working out, cause I know I'm. The, I have the body type. Like if I start working out, I'll get buff real quick. But the problem with that is like I stop working out. I stop being buff real quick. <laughs> so I just gotta keep working out. Both but sides of the spectrum. Word. I get I get sexy in three weeks. <laughs> and I get comfortable. And get comfortable. I'm like, damn, I'm sexy. And then I start with that's that. I get I get. Pleased with my results too fast. For real. Yeah, that's Lose my that problem. That shit in like yeah. a day and a half. Word. God forbid you Actually, made it. Exactly my problem. Well, that, like, like one, I, like I see, oh snap, I a line there that wasn't there before. Bro, yeah. when I see a new vein, <laughs> Word, it's over. It's like, Word. oh, I'm good. I'm good. I don't need to work out anymore. Word. What's the reason for it? Let me get some. <laughs> let me get some. Accomplished. Let me get some wing stuff. <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, I can eat wings off at a salad at night. There's wings and salad. <laughs> let me get 15 mango habanero. I just, <laughs> I just got an ab. <laughs> Hell y'all, yeah. y'all got any of them specialty flavors? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I had mango hab... Uh, Sidebar, this is it. Brazilian I had line. mango habanero yesterday for the first time. Yeah. It's so deceiving. Yeah. You eat it and it tastes so good, but once it you start hot, swallowing hot. it, it's, it's just like, oh, what's happening? It's, <laughs> it's so hot, dog. It's ass, crazy. Man. And I eat 10 of those. Oh, Lord. At least <laughs> once a week. It's terrible. Real nigga. You a what nigga, up? man. <laughs> Real nigga, what up? <laughs> but yeah, as, as far as resolutions go, like, I mean, I, I, I don't mean to sound like a Debbie Downer. We need to find another phrase, a Debbie Downer, but like, it, all right, I, I think I read a statistic that 8% of people keep their resolutions. Mm-hmm. 8%? Right. Yeah, you, you, you can't... You heard that. You, heard you that can't movie. win any case ever on any subject with 8% of your evidence. Like, 8%? Nope. Yeah. Come on, dog. And they're usually done by, like, February. Yeah. yeah. February. That's the worst. So, maybe I'm being pessimistic. Maybe I'm being... Shit, maybe I'm being um cynical, maybe. Mm. Mm. But just like look at the percentage, like you know, just make your goals. If your goals take longer than usual, then it I mean, rolls over into the next so year. Like, grant, like, granted, that eight percent is based on a questionnaire that a certain amount of people answer. Mm. But still, 
Yo, those are we the most do accurate. Know, we do know that if you ever been to the gym, mm-hmm. I know I used to work at the gym. I worked at LA Fitness for a minute. Mm-hmm. Fuck y'all. Um, <laughs> Take take that out in case you get a sponsorship. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> why so defensive, bro? Right? <laughs> oh, well, they, they, they eliminated my position nationwide and didn't have something else for me. Ah, oh, did yeah. they touch you? <laughs> Show us on the dog. Anybody have a violin? <laughs> the smallest. <laughs> That's the um, smallest one. Nah, um, basically, by February 12th. Mm. It's empty. Again. It's back to normal, man. Yeah, it's a regular ass gym. Feb- oh, so, a month. Yeah, you might have a few people that really work. It is on close, it, but man. honestly, by March, you pretty much filtered out everyone who wasn't serious about the gym, who just made a New Year's resolution. Mm. And I worked there for two New Year cycles. Mm. Like I worked there for a year, but I was there so, okay. for one New Year then the next, and I was like, wow. So let me. <laughs> so let's say a hundred people start the new. I'm gonna get fit, New Year's resolution mm-hmm. or whatever. I'm finna get In fit. March, how many people are left? Out of if I'm gonna base it off a hundred and I'm terrible with numbers, yeah. legit, you're gonna look at like forty people left. Mm. Forty mm. out like of legit. That's, that's, that's more than that's half. My guess. That's more than half. That's so, yeah. my assumption. Like so, it, it went from the gym, you gotta wait for a machine for at least a couple minutes. Mm-hmm. Any given machine mm-hmm. on January first to back to normal, where there's those particular machines that not a lot of people use, mm. that no one use. Or or you got your areas of the gym. You just have your regular gym rats. You know, so, it's, it's, the, it's okay. the regular so, crowd. So Shabby, what 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 advice would you give somebody? Or like, what what are mm. some of the like if somebody wanted to make a resolution and stick to it? And stick to it. Honestly, yeah. you gotta hold yourself accountable. Like, how important is it to you? Mm. Like, mm-hmm. is it because as humans we don't face immediate consequences for our health. Right. So, therefore, we're not acting as if it's going to be a problem until it becomes a problem. Oh, facts. So, it has to be extremely important to you that you stay fit and healthy. Mm -hmm. But that has to be your preference. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, it has to be that important to you. And that small percentage of people who do continue on with whatever goals or resolutions they set, Mm. well, that's why they're successful with them. And it may not be working out. Um, you, you, You have to really sit down with yourself. And, and say, is this something that I really want? Word. And if you really want it, then there's no reason why you shouldn't work towards it. That's true. Because what what the hell else are you doing with your time? True. Be your meat? Word. Whoa. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> that, uh, I got dark. I just said word right after you said that. Like, <laughs> yeah, <back> confirmation. <laughs> <laughs> like, be your meat word. Yeah. Yeah. Be your meat word. That's what and Flock also, is doing. <laughs> and also, um, <laughs> along with that, just write stuff down. Plan stuff out. Plan and help. <laughs> are, are we done laughing? <laughs> Well, you're right. Yeah, but plan stuff out. Write it down. Plan it out. Get like Definitely. give yourself have a plan for real, for real. Yeah, and, like, real and, talk. And Make the reason, this plan and I do in October can I at just, least. <laughs> can I emphasize something real quick to just touch on what you're saying? Writing it. I can't express how important writing. Not writing in your notes in your phone or whatever. Like actually writing something down. If you have a calendar that's like a whiteboard or or a calendar in general that you keep in your We're house. We're not all rich, okay. Write it. <laughs> it's called Walmart. <laughs> like I said, no, stop. Nah. <laughs> you, have, you have walls? No. Walls? <laughs> I don't know where to hang anything. <laughs> Dude, I got cloth. How you hang? <laughs> it? Uh, hang. Um, hang. Hang what? <laughs> Sleep on the tree. <laughs> <laughs> <But>, um, <laughs> nah, if you if you if you create a visual mm. that is it's tangible meaning something you wrote down, something that's right in front of you, and you see that, and it is something that's important to you, an important goal, then it will stay in your mind. Mm-hmm. And you will remember it at some point in the day when you have a second to think. Mm-hmm. And, and, and I think having something that's there, fit that you could physically touch, like you could you know, wipe the ink, Mm. With your finger, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like it's a real thing. Making it tangible. Just yeah. like your thought your thoughts are real things. They take up space in your brain. Mm-hmm. Um so like it treat it as such and it's just as important. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And a ba- a That's main a thing that attributes to it is, is habits. Yeah. You know, good yes. and and bad, you yeah. know. To to shake bad habits and to 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 start sus- good ones. Start and sustain good ones, you know, like um let's say it takes twenty eight days. Mm-hmm. To, yeah. to start a habit, right? You know that's that that's not an easy thing to do. 
doing mm-hmm. anything for 28 days. So it's now, like you got to bite anything, that bullet. Yeah. Or not doing anything yeah, for 28 yeah. days. Exactly, also. exactly. But to think about it, mm. after 28 days, it's easier. If it's important, yeah. it's a lot easier. Yeah. yeah. And, I mean, and it can week. become a regular practice. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like the shit you, the things you do now <laughs> <laughs> that are normal practices mm-hmm. that you don't like or desire can change in less than a month. Yeah. Mm hmm. If you care about it enough. Yeah, mm-hmm. if you change your mindset, change your habits. Honestly, anything is possible within mm-hmm. a short amount of time. Absolutely. Now, now the one thing I will add on to um, as far as like writing it down and setting the goal is keep it. I mean, keep yourself not, not just keep yourself accountable, but like take the long term goal and break it into short term goals. Mm-hmm. So if you got to be somewhere, if you got to be a point Z. By December, you want to be a point D by January. You want to be a point K by, you know what I mean? By, yeah. by July. Because <laughs> most people get overwhelmed by their goals. You yeah. might look yeah. at it too big as a whole. But truth be told, we have to break everything down and take it one step at a time. Yeah, yeah. no matter how That's so big important. or small it is. That's yeah. so important, Mr. That's true. Maier, that you said that. And even, I mean, and along the road, you, I mean, you're going to have successes. You're going to have failures. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? You want to... You want to treat each accordingly. You want to learn from your failures. Don't be too hard mm-hmm. on yourself. Exactly. Mm-hmm. You want to you want to celebrate your successes. But I mean, just keeping if you keep on reminding yourself, keep on refreshing that schedule, that goal. I mean, eventually you're gonna hit it, or eventually you're gonna see progress. Mm-hmm. You know what Indeed. I mean? I think we could all agree on that. Yeah. Word. Yeah. That's I'm, facts. Word. I'm glad you said like don't get on get hard on yourself when you fail, because I feel like once yes. people fail, they give up on, yeah. on, on on their either their resolution or mm-hmm. like you know. Cause it's like, you could you could you could feel like you know, at, at any given point you could you could press the reset button and say, All right, I'm starting to fresh now. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. You know, and it, and and it's it's little stuff too that you do. Um, you mentioned like what your what your living space and what you do like that. That's huge. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, once you tidy up mm-hmm. your living space. It, it's it like it frees up your mind. Clear so space, I, clear yeah. mind, clear man. space. Yeah, so I feel, right, yeah. yeah, I feel like I, that'll be the first thing you wanna, you wanna, you wanna, um, you wanna get stuff going. You wanna get on like you know a good path of like you know setting goals, making them, and just more of a productive path. I'd say first step. Clean your surroundings. Organize your surroundings. Stop mm-hmm. being dirty, nigga. <laughs> exactly. Shit, don't what change I did. until you get up and wash your ass. <laughs> 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 Never. Right. Shit, don't Do not start change your day until, until you wash, wash your, your ass. ass. <laughs> Message from TPS. Honestly, yeah, everything we said could be summed up in that. Don't do nothing till you, you wash, wash your, your ass. ass. Yeah, your real ass. talk. Yeah, that's hey, facts though. That's that that might that's be the title of the episode because you go feel yeah. uncomfortable. Damn, shit, don't I'm doing change. this shit. I ain't washed my ass yet. Word. Like, come For on, real. I might get that tatted on my arm. It's still on, stink on, from on my last thumb. On your thumb. <laughs> why so look at shit it? Don't why change. the thumb? <laughs> so I look at it every. So I look at it every every time I pray. I'm gonna put my shout out future. I'm gonna look at it every time I pray. Don't move till you wash your ass. Constant reminder. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna you gonna have a picture of Vic Rames above <laughs> your bed pointing at you. Don't, move. <laughs> Don't fucking move till you wash your ass. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't so, behind your ears or nothing. <laughs> <laughs> so all in all. Oh, I was just gonna add one thing on to the to the don't be too hard on yourself. Yeah. Okay. I don't okay, know okay, if we okay. got time for that, but no no, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. oh, for instance, like let's say you, you want to drive from Miami to Orlando, mm. but somewhere you make a wrong left turn, you're not gonna beat yourself up, say "f it," drive back to Miami. Right? You no, know, you go, okay, I'm not gonna make a left there anymore. You yeah. go correct your mistake and continue on your yeah. way to Orlando. So right. it's just something to keep in mind. You know what I mean? And also to keep it relevant. I don't know how you made a wrong left. GPS exists, bro. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, being silly, I'm being silly. GPS be sending you the wrong way sometimes, man. Turn left into canal. See, <laughs> all of this is an analogy. <laughs> For, <laughs> wash your ass, nigga. Don't, don't move till you wash your, wash your ass. Because your if shit, you had bro. washed your ass, you would remember to For carry real. your GPS. If, you understand? If you don't know what that means, exit that app right now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, for real. This you're going to have to go to another podcast that's going to break it down a little for bit real. more simply. Bruh, bruh. <laughs> 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 hey, we're going to change lives with that. For, no, somebody go be, somebody going to be explaining this episode to somebody else. Yeah. Like, what was it about? Like, 
My yeah. nigga, just wash your ass before you do anything. <laughs> yeah, yeah, basically. <laughs> Point blank, period. The name of the book huh? coming out in 2032. <laughs> don't move till you wash your ass. Uh-huh. Uh, memoirs. <laughs> you gonna turn into a dance. Don't move till you wash your ass. Hey. <laughs> don't move Word. till you wash your ass. And with the left, and with the right, don't move till you wash your ass. Huh? Don't you know, move till you wash your ass. That, hey. That's it. Oh, nigga said spread it. Lather up. Mm. <laughs> Lather up. Yeah. Now wow. spray the hole. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. This is Zulu. End this, please. Oh man. Kill this monster we've created. I, was just, oh, I, I thought we were trying to see how graphic we could get. Oh, <laughs> you don't want to do that. <laughs> man. Hey, and don't think what we're telling you is real talk. You yeah, know man. What I'm this is from experience. Yeah. Yeah. That whole don't move to you. <laughs> like rich, rich people know this. That's why they have the bidet. Exactly. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Right. It's real. They wash their ass but they, times a day. Bidets <laughs> aren't a mistake. You got to realize that at one point, bidets became so important, they start mass producing them. So exactly. You don't mass yeah. produce just nothing. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> bidets yeah, were like, important, so it was like, word. don't move to you wash your yeah. ass. Like, word. You, you think... Has these anyone seen a have, bidet in person? These, yes. These my grandma has one my in Jamaica. Yeah. Right now got one. <laughs> you think, my grandma got one too. That's crazy. You think these people have bidets because they're successful? No. They're, they're, they're successful, successful because, because they have bidets. God, ah, ah, that's we, another quote from this yo, episode. They're so, successful because they have bidets. And with that, <laughs> and with that, we shall conclude our first episode of 2018. Woo! <laughs> insert insert um <laughs> crowd <laughs> chair. Insert <laughs> gunfire <laughs> and blow horns. <laughs> and to my left, that is it's a boy David Bomaye, aka Chico Fantastico, aka. You know what? Uh, I'm gonna go with the new one, Black Yoshi. Black Yoshi. Ah, Black Yoshi. Yoshi. Hey. Hey. Bop, bop. And uh, you know, and to my right, I got this is Flock of Zulu, aka Sir Blackstone the Third, aka Pablo Escovich, aka. No bird checks 2018. Hey. <laughs> At a year. Not to be confused with. Not to be confused with bird checks. No bird checks 2017. Or no bird checks 2016. Or no bird checks 2015. <laughs> or no bird checks 2014. <laughs> They're on until so 2010. So far, so far. But it is your boy, Mr. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Are you, Mr. Are you even dramatic without the beard? I am dramatic. I'm just not Wavy McBeard anymore. Oh, man. Stop trying to act like you your daddy, bro. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> you your daddy, son. Hey. <laughs> but yeah. AKA. Oh, how Mr. To, dramatic, AKA. How the uh, Grinch Wave stole my Chappelle, mustache. AKA. <laughs> how the Grinch stole my mustache. <laughs> AKA. Wavy McGrady, AKA. Captain Cashew, <laughs> <laughs> AKA. Black Galifianakis. Oh. AKA. Baird soon come. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know who it is. It's your boy. I seen black, aka Wade Bixby, sometimes, aka Black Dynamite. Also, always Swiss Army nigga. Swiss Army nigga. All right, that's it. That's it. All right, we, we got to end up. So. All right. But um, Swiss Army nigga. <laughs> tune in every week. Walking oh, down um. The street. And for those of y'all who don't know, which is everybody, everybody. basically, uh, we drop in episodes every Tuesday and Thursday now. So um, enjoy your Monday with yeah. Garfield, eat your lasagna, and <laughs> have your Tuesdays and Thursdays with TPSG. Yeah, That's it, TPSG, baby. But um, it's a new year, but the rules have not changed, and they will never change. Because we make them. <laughs> so you make sure you go home and slowly slip. Take a shot. Up on my sofa booty and do it and we'll make sure it's y'all. not you yeah <laughs> that's weird <laughs> we will see y'all next episode Deuces. Deuces. happy Deuces. new year people Deuces.